Hi boys and girls, welcome to story time today and this special book is called Russell the Sheep. It's a story about a sheep that cannot go to sleep. And you know, what does everybody need? A good friend. I want you to look for the frog on every page and see if you could find him. Alright, let's start. It's written by Rob Scotton, and he's also the illustrator. Look at that hat. Russell the sheep lived in Frog Bottom Field. At the end of a long busy day and look grandma's knitting and she's using the sheep wool right there night fell and the sheep got ready for bed soon all was quiet except for look right here what's in grandma's glass except for Russell no matter how hard he tried Russell could not fall asleep maybe if it were really dark he thought I'd be able to sleep but the really dark really scared him. Perhaps I'm too hot, he thought. Perhaps I'm not. Russell pulled up a pillow, but the pillow hopped away, hopping mad. Maybe I need a better place to sleep, he decided, and went for a walk. Russell spied the trunk of a rusty car. It was too cramped. He tried the hollow of a tree. That was too creepy. Russell even tried sleeping on a branch, but it was too crowded. What's a sheep to do? Russell thought he would never get to sleep, but then he had a brilliant idea. What if he tried to count things? That would make him fall asleep. Russell counted his feet. One, two, three, four, not tired. Hmm, I guess I need more feet, he decided. What next? The stars! Russell counted each and every one. One, two, three, four, five, six hundred million billion and ten. And Russell was wide awake. He counted them again. Six hundred million billion and ten. And still wide awake. Russell thought very hard. In fact, he thought so hard, his hat went ziggy zaggy. I know, he shouted. I'll count sheep. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, Still awake, he said, and sighed. Then Russell realized he had forgotten to count one very important little sheep. Who do you think it was? Himself! Ten! Russell felt a tickle, then a twitch, and then sound asleep.
By now it was morning, and all the other sheep in the field began getting ready for the new day. This says wash and go, sheep flakes. Soon everyone was up, everyone that is except for Russell. What a sweet book. Parents, here's a list of all of the other books that I have read so far. Mrs. Toggle's Zipper, Moose's Loose Tooth, Dumpy LaRue, Love You Too, Barnyard Boogie, and Russell the Sheep. Thank you very much, and I will see you later. Bye.